Hello friends. In this video I will show you how to export animation from Krita to OpenTunes so we can do some advanced editing and coloring. And here is an animation that we will use as an example. The first thing to do is to make sure that the resolution of our animation is set to 120 dpi. Otherwise it would be displayed with an incorrect size when imported into OpenTunes. Let's open the image menu at the top. And select there scale the image to new size. Make sure that the adjust print size separately option is enabled. If it's not, then the image would be resized according to resolution, and this is not what we need. We can see that in this file the resolution is set to 6000 dpi. Let's change it. Click OK. The next step is to add a white background to make OpenTunes better recognize the outline. To do that, create a new layer and fill it with white. In the edit menu, choose fill with background color. Next, we need to make sure that all areas are closed with outlines. In this specific case, the outline looks quite good, so the only thing we need is to add a line at the bottom to close the body area of the character. Be sure to do this on a separate layer, so it appears on every frame at once, so then in OpenTunes, we won't have to close the area on every frame manually. Let's move on to exporting the animation. Open the file menu at the top. And choose render animation there. Here we need to pay attention to the following parameters. First, we need to make sure we are exporting an image sequence. Secondly, we need to be sure to select the TIFF image file format. OpenTunes supports this format much better. Next, choose a file path where to export the animation sequence. One more important thing. In the base name field, we have to write frame and put a dot afterwards. This dot is strictly required, otherwise OpenTunes won't recognize our files as a sequence. And last but not least, enable the checkbox only unique frames. That makes Krita export keyframes only. This will be helpful during importing and also saves the disk space. We are done with the settings, click OK and wait for the animation to be exported. Done. The sequence is ready to be imported into OpenTunes. And this is exactly what we are going to do in the next video.